Hi, this is Shiva Rajaya from VitalCoaching.com and we are talking about vital sex and tantric sex. And the topic for this video is how to create sacred space. Creating a sacred space is one of the most important aspects to generate a beautiful experience with your partner, with your lover. The way you do that um, is you bring certain core elements into your space and inside of you. The first tip here is to use mantras, sacred words, words of power. A very simple sequence or set of words that you can use is simply Shiva Shakti. Shiva is the ideal divine masculine and Shakti is the ideal divine feminine. When you are using these words Shiva Shakti what you are doing is invoking the divine female and male archetypes inside of you and in your couple. And the way you will do that is simply by singing this mantra together. You can be standing or sitting and you just engage into this mantra. I demonstrate this mantra in other videos so I'm just going to give you a hint here about how it works but please go and check my channel for more videos on these powerful mantras. So you simply repeat it in that form. Shiva Shakti 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 There are many other mantras that you can use but you get the idea right use the power of sound and the power of mantric invocation to create the sacred space Another technique to bring sacred space is to create rituals. So rituals are any form of conscious action, gest gesture, thought pattern, behavior that you bring into the sacred space to precisely uh, educate the elemental forces around you. So. A very simple ritual is this one. You stand in front of your partner in prayer position with your hands on your heart and you just look at each other. This is already a ritual. It's a very simple gesture that is invoking and saying, let's go internally, let's invoke a certain set of forces and energies many many more rituals. The third aspect to create a sacred space is intention. See you can use sex for all sorts of things. You can use sex to procreate just for pleasure, for emotional release. The idea to dedicate your sexual space to energies that are much vaster than yourself to divine presence is a very conscious intention and choice. And the moment you start directing this energy into your sacred space, into your tantric space, then you are going to bring in a vibration, a frequency that includes the conscious presence of energies, intelligences that are much vaster than ourselves. So we are talking about consciously bringing in gods and goddesses, angelic powers, and so on. The next tip is invocations. So invocations are conscious prayers, meditation forms. For instance, if you enter into the tantric sex space and you sit in front of your partner, and you say something like, 
I call the divine masculine inside of me so that the divine feminine inside of you can show up. I offer this space, this moment, in total dedication to the planet and humankind. We want to offer the love that we will generate here to all beings, all living forms around us. We want to invoke the power of joy, bliss, and bring all these beautiful, positive qualities in what we are about to share. See, this is a very simple prayer. It's a very simple invocation that is going to invoke beautiful qualities in the sacred space that you are creating. Tip number five is clear the space. To make it sacred, it's important that you get rid of bills, paperwork that you might have in your bedroom. Create beauty. Remove the elements of, that remind you of work. Things like laptop, computers, technology. If you have, if you are having sex, right? Tantric sex there, and you are trying to connect really with your partner on a deeper level, and you have this bill sitting on, <laughs> on the bedroom table there, and your eyes keep being polarized by it, of course it's going to remind you of a, something which is very different and what's happening right there. So it brings worries, it brings stress, it brings all sorts of qualities that you don't really want to have in the tantric sex space. Tip number six is start opening up energetically. Go beyond the realms of the physical, beyond the realms of the physical pleasure. We are talking about opening up your life to realities and spaces which go way, way deeper than that. So the energetic preparation of your body and your mind and the space between you and your partner involves techniques that I call vital force techniques. So dynamic breathing, shaking, doing some postures, using mantras and so on. This is a preparation space that you can have. The idea when you engage into the tantric sex space and want to sacralize this environment is really to stay aware, stay super present, aware of the dynamics and the energies. What are you really saying? What are you really doing? How are you touching your partner? How are you looking at each other? So this idea of being very present, not distracted, is also a key aspect of creating sacred space. And then, of course, beautify the place. Bring colors and beauty, uh, incense, pictures, reminders of the sacredness of the divine um, sexual union. You know, candles, oils, all these aspects that are going to beautify the place. Have some flowers, have some fresh fruit, these kind of things. I hope this makes sense. I'm going to summarize them for you again. Mantras, rituals, intentions, invocations, clear the space, stay aware of energies, and beautify the tantric sex space. Go for it. Enjoy.